Hi there, in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to use the Pathfinder Exclude button to cut out objects from a circle to make this little smiley face. The overall process is really easy, just like anything else I've shown in Pathfinder. So yeah, let's get to it. Alright, so the first thing we're going to do is just going to throw down some objects. I'm just going to draw a face for shits and giggles. So to do this, I'm just going to grab my ellipse tool on the side here and just holding Alt and Shift, draw out a circle like so, and then throw down some eyes on top of it like that and then I'm going to paste in the semicircle which I did from my previous tutorial you can check that out if you want to so I'm just going to paste that in by putting, hitting control V and then just grabbing my pointer tool position it in place like so now obviously because all the objects are the same colors we're not going to see anything so we can switch to outline view to have a look what the face is going to look like by pressing control Y and we can move things around in this view as well just to have a rough idea what it's going to look like. There you go, that's looking pretty funny. Alright, by pressing Ctrl Y again, we can toggle back out of our wireframe view. And just using our pointer tool, we select the entire lot. Now, to cut these top objects out of the base circle was really quite easy. We're going to go up to our Pathfinder tool. Again, if you don't have the Pathfinder tool, you can always select it through the window option and just making sure there's a tick there next to it. Now we're going to use a, option, a tool called Exclude Overlapping Shape Areas. So what we're going to do, just making sure that all the shapes are selected, we're going to hold Alt and we're going to hit this one here, the Exclude button. So once we've hit that, what they'll do is we'll cut out all the shapes that are sitting on top of the circle so they're see-through. To illustrate that we can just draw a shape there make him, I don't know, blue, and we'll just send that shape to the back by pressing Control shift uh, left bracket, and they'll send the object to the back, and there you go, you can see that those have been cut out of that circle, and they're now see through. So yeah, there you have it, I hope you have enjoyed um, my three videos on the Pathfinder tool, it's a very handy tool, and I suggest you use it wherever you can. So if you found this tutorial helpful, feel free to hit the like button, subscribe also, that always helps. Um, if you haven't already, please check out the other tutorials I've done on Pathfinder, and yeah, have a nice day.